Real YouTubers make a video. <laughs> Uh, I forgot the tune. Oh no, um, this video is about Regulation G. Hello, welcome. Hi everyone, I am WolfGlick, 2016 Pokemon World Champion. You might know me from such, uh, shows as WolfGlick, um, and, um, w Bonus Wolf. Uh, okay, so, Regulation G just dropped the next... Um, regulation of Pokemon Scarlet and Violet before we get the next games, um, Pokemon Red and Blue 2. Um, so, and this rule set allows for one restricted Pokemon on each team. And a restricted Pokemon is like these Pokemon you see on screen. I don't know why it has Ogre Pond, that's not a restricted Pokemon. Um, it's actually a goblin. Uh, but here we have the two dragons, uh, Coridon and Miraidon, and then Terrapagos who is a, not a dragon, but is a, a uh, restricted Pokemon. Um, and we're going to kind of go through some of the ones I found the most notable me. Most click Worlds 2016, 2024, Pokemon World Champion. Um, uh, yeah, so first one is, I need to zoom out, I think. Do I have the music playing? I don't have the music playing. Let me soothe you with some musical tunes. There you go. Thank you, Glitch X City, for your contribution. Um, so our first Pokemon we're going to look at is Kyogre, because why not? Um, Kyogre is a whale who sets the rain, and as we all know, rain is really, really important in VGC, because, um, yeah, it, it just is. Um, it has some good stats, a good offensive attack stat, uh, base 100, that's really, really good. Um, you're not going to really use its special attack so much. I know the number looks kind of high. Don't worry about it. It's kind of fake. It doesn't really get any special moves at all. Um, it is a trick room user, sometimes sort of base, base 90 speed. Um, so let's look at some of the physical moves that Kyogre gets, because again, you'll never use um, the special ones. Uh, we have Body Slam, which is a good move. Uh, can leave it with a Paralysis. Uh, yeah, and that's definitely important. Paralysis is really, really good. Speed is very important. Um, when you are playing the video game. Um, Scary Face is also a good move because it lowers their stats. Uh, Water Pulse, Origin Pulse, you don't really need. Um, they might be stabbed, but they're really not that strong. Uh, Aqua Tail is really, really good physical move. Uh, base 90 attack and base 90 accuracy, that's really, really high. Um, it's not quite 100, but it's still pretty good. And you know what they say, 90% accurate. It's 90% accurate. And then we have Double Edge, which, eh, Body Slam is kind of better because you get the, the bonus with the Paralyze. Um, yeah, so Pokemon you want to pair this with is Barrascuta. Barrascuta is really good. Uh, it has Swift Swim mobility. Um, other Pokemon... Ludicolo, maybe? He likes to dance. A uh, really good Terra type for Kyogre is Ground type because uh, that way you don't get hit by the electric moves that are gonna be really popular because of our uh, next Pokemon, who is uh, Miraidon, who will set electric terrain because of its Hadron engine. And you know, you don't want um, anything taking advantage of those electric moves. That's why you tear ground your Kyogre. Uh, this Pokemon is a bicycle. Um, so because of that, it has a pretty good speed stat, 135 ties it with Fluttermane. So it is 135 special attack. Um, so, you know, Finally, Fluttermane has a counter. Uh, this is a dragon type, so it does kind of lose to Fluttermane. Um, but it's not all all bad. Uh, it has the move Electro Drift, which if you've ever seen Akira, it kind it's kind of like that. Um, Hyper Beam is kind of a cool move. Anything else? Agility? It's already pretty fast. You probably don't need agility. Um, basically, this is going to be replacing your Pincurchins that you know everyone sees on ladder all the time. I know I've went to a local and there was a guy running Pincurchin Iron Hands um, and he won. So uh, at least the battle I was watching. It also has Dragon Pulse, which is a move that it gets um, that does damage. Um, Outrage you probably don't want to use because you don't you want to be able to switch in and out your terrain. Uh, those Rillabooms are really going to be kind of trying to write you, overwrite your terrain and so will Indeedee's. Um, Maridon is a Pokemon I'm bringing to the 2024 uh, World Championship, um, by the way. 
So a little little insight there. Um, before the leakers leak my whole team, I want to leak it first. So I'm bringing me right on. Uh, the next Pokemon I want to talk about is the Dunsparce because it's finally legal. It gets Serene Grace, which doubles its uh, secondary effects, meaning you can uh, outspeed and rock slide flinch your opponents forever. Um, and then you run it with Landorus Therian and rock slide crit, rock slide, flinch, flinch, rock slide, flinch, flinch, flinch. Uh, and then they just have a bad time um, overall. I will say 55 speed is not great for the Dunsparce, uh, but it is really, really good. In Trick Room, it is, I think it's slower than Ferrigraph. Yeah, slower than Ferrigraph, so you don't even need to worry about Ferrigraph in Trick Room. Um, you can just flinch it uh, with your Serene Grace Rock Slide. You can break through its Protect with Giga Drill, Hyper Drill, Hyper Drill, that's the move, um, which does break through Protect. Uh, it's kind of a broken move, um, and it's really, really balanced. Um, by uh, not being on Urshifu, which we all know Urshifu doesn't hit through Protect at all. So uh, it's no problem, go away, add. Um, the next Pokemon I wanna talk about is Groudon. He's a very handsome Pokemon. Um, I actually have a Groudon plush of him. This is Gordon. Um, he is my favorite Pokemon plush that I own. Cause yeah, look at him, right? So Gordon is going to stay right here until he falls down. Um, which is right now. Uh, so Groudon is like the opposite of Kyogre, except um, instead of water, it's dry. They gave it a towel and dried off Kyogre and you get Groudon. Um, Groudon is pretty good. Uh, has Precipice Blades. Does it actually have Precipice Blades? Pre press, press. Precipice Blades, it still has Precipice Blades. Oh my gosh. Um, it also has Fissure, everyone's favorite move. I know it's a really healthy game in the meta, uh, move in the meta game right now. Um, it also gets Eruption and Solar Beam, uh, which are two really powerful attacks. Uh, Eruption is really, really good. Uh, it, this also means you don't need to use Torkoal or Ninetales anymore because, uh, yeah, you have Groudon. Um, um, the next Pokemon we're going to talk about is one of my favorites. It's Rayquaza. If you remember, I won 2016 Worlds with Rayquaza Swords Dance. Unfortunately, they did remove Swords Dance from Rayquaza, so I can't do that anymore. Um, Rayquaza is just really, really bad. It says here Swords Dance, ignore it, it's wrong. Um, but it does get Surf. Surf is really important, especially if you want to run Gastrodon Stratch. Strats, excuse me. Um... Its attack and its special attack are really high. It's 150, which is pretty good. It also gets Dragon Shear, which is a really, uh, it's a move. Uh, anything else about Rayquaza? No, he's green. I like green Rayquaza. Uh, yeah. Um, next up is Cosmog. Uh, your only really use for Cosmog is to evolve it into Sogaleo and Lunala eventually, um, which you can do uh in battle now especially if you terra uh you get to skip the cosmo evolution you evolve straight into lanala um and it's really really strong uh you its stats for, grow by like 40 times uh so these are wrong um but that's okay and also splash turns into like z super splash yeah by the way they're bringing back z moves um in gen 10 just so you know uh and yeah, uh, it, it'll do like at least 300 damage um, when it splashes on its target. So keep an eye out for Cosmog during like Gen 10 Season 1. Uh, it'll still be relevant during, you know, uh, this regulation, Regulation G, the current new regulation where they add one mythical Pokemon. Um, what's next? Zacian. Zacian is the most unhealthy Pokemon in the game, uh, besides Incineroar. Um, yeah, I don't really want to talk about Zacian, so I'm not going to. A Zamazenta though, I like Zamazenta. He has a big, he's like a dinner plate uh, on legs. Um, he, he does body press stuff. Zamazenta raises its defense very much to very high numbers and then squishes your opponents. Um, with body press. I got nothing else about it. It's, it's Zamazenta. Uh, and then we get to Calyrex, who 
has the biggest noggin of all Pokemon in the game, um, and therefore it's the best and most broken. We don't really use base Calyrex, we use Calyrex Ice or Calyrex Shadow. Uh, Calyrex Shadow is very fast and very super special attacker, uh, and Calyrex Ice is very slow and physical attacker. Um, they're both really, really good, uh, and they're really, really broken, and they have really, really broken moves. They both hit uh, your opponent for super duper damage. Um, one is really, really fast, and one is really, really slow, so it's good in Trick Room. Um, I actually brought Calyrex Ice to Worlds 2022, um, and then I went, I think, 2-3, and I lost. Um, yeah. Um, so that's Calyrex. What what does it get? It gets Giga Drain. Okay. Uh, next up is Coridon, who is kind of like Crowdon, um, but yeah, different. Um, it boosts its attack in the sunlight, and it also enters sunlight or turns on sunlight, um, which is better than what Groudon does, which is just turn on sunlight. This Pokemon is also as fast as Fluttermane and has 135 sp physical attack, so it can actually hit Fluttermane for like big damage. Uh, but yeah, uh, Coridon's gonna be really, really good. Um, even though it's kind of weak to Fluttermane, you can still tear away from it. Uh, Terra Steel uh, is probably good for it. Um, Collision Course is its, um, is its signature move, uh, which does more damage on a super effective hit. And it's a fighting type, so if you're against like, I don't know, man, uh, steel types, rock types, Clamora, you punch it, it's probably going down. Um, this thing's really, really good, essentially. Um, any other Pokemon that I missed so far? Terrapagos. Terrapagos is sure, certainly a Pokemon who will use Terra Stellar. Um, it has like four, three or four abilities uh, that all change depending on um, what form it's in. Um, and then it has a really confusing move and then a really confusing uh, Terra effect. So when you do Terra, your Terrapagos into Terra Stellar, um, his move is gonna do a different thing, but it's really, really confusing because it's different from every other Terra Stellar thing, Terra Stellar Pokemon, and Terra Stellar is already incredibly confusing all by itself. Um, so honestly, don't even bother learning it. Uh, no one's gonna use it anyway because, uh, yeah, no one, no one's gonna figure out. No one even knows what its, its abilities do and like what its attacks do. So don't worry about it. And next up is Mewtwo, which is arguably the best Pokemon um, introduced um, in this regulation because yeah, it's Mewtwo. Uh, look at him. Um, it has a nerve, um, which, you know, is really, really, uh, good in a lot of situations. You know, Amoongus can't eat their citrus berries, um, and you can't have a lumberry on your Tinglu. Uh, it won't work. Um, so yeah, it's really, really good in a lot of situations. Um, go away. I don't want an ad, please. Um... Uh, it also gets Disable, which, uh, I mean, if you remember from my me winning Orlando 2023, is that the year? Uh, I used Disable on my Screamtail. Um, and the only reason I used Screamtail is because I didn't have access to Mewtwo. So, uh, it's really, really good. Um, it also gets Recover, which heals itself. Uh, and healing is really important in VGC because uh, a lot of Pokemon don't heal especially when they are unnerved and they can't eat their citrus berries. Um, so it's really, really important that you be able to heal Mewtwo. And as we know, Mewtwo is really, really frail. So as, as we all know, you really want to keep its HP high. Um, it also gets uh, Weather Ball, which in conjunction with um, Pelipper, uh, it can be really, really strong. It also gets Trick Room, which you're not going to be using with base 130 speed. That's really fast. An item I recommend with Mewtwo is probably Citrus Berry, because you'll still be able to eat your berries, but your opponent won't be able to eat their berries. And it's just kind of a flex. Um, and it adds more healing to Mewtwo to keep it alive. 
Uh, you also get Icy Wind, which is a really good supporting move uh, to make sure that you are faster. In fact, you can slow down Fluttermane. Does Mewtwo get Expanding Force? I think that's a really um, important thing. It does get Expanding Force. So actually, indeedy, Expanding Force Mewtwo is really, really good. Um, I recommend testing it out and trying it. Um, and once again, I think that's the last Pokemon that I care about. Ho-Oh is in the game, who cares about Ho-Oh? Lugia is in the game, who cares about Lugia? Um, Tialga, Palkia, I don't even know if their origin forms are legal, who who cares? We have Mewtwo, we have Coridon, uh, we have Dodunsparce, like why would you ever need anything else other than those three? Uh, I think Dodunsparce especially, paired with um, Landorus, and then uh, other Coridon teams are going to do really, really well, especially like um, when paired with Pokemon like uh, Great Tusk um, and of course Fluttermane uh, and then Mewtwo and DD teams are really going to take over the meta. So make sure you stay tuned for that. I will be laddering with all of these Pokemon. That's a promise. Um, that is a promise 100% that I'm not going to break. I will do that because I said I would. Um, yeah, uh, last closing thoughts is right. I'm looking forward to regulation G it's going to be the world's format. Um, so it's a really, really important format to get right. And also I do want to remind you, uh, not to try at worlds 2024 because I am already the world's 2024 champion that decide these things like a half a year in advance. I don't make the rules, but okay, that's the end of the video. I think I have said all I had to say about reg regulation G and I will see you, uh, on tomorrow's bonus wolf. Um, thank you for watching. Uh, bye. Bye.